So I just thought I'd give a just a brief overview of the Sunco 737DH uh, with the automatic um, uh, push down spot welding uh, tips. So where you push push that down and the um, and then it automatically spot welds the the weld. Um, I've got the sitting now that I've just done this battery pack on. Uh, so what's that? Uh, 4P and this power sitting, I'm not sure if you can see it there, is about six and a half. Um, and I'm on 240 volts in Australia. So um, so I've just done this battery pack with that. Um, this is the first battery pack that I've done, so I'm no expert uh, at this. Um, but from what I can see, it's done a good job um, regards to the spot welds. And if I just turn it over, so that's the design that um, I've take, got off someone else um, regards to this pack. The only, uh, the lesson so far is that I could have changed a little bit to minimise that type of thing. So where the plastic, uh, where you go through the slots there. So, but I just wanted to give as much ability to the current to, to flow. So this is the other side. Um, I don't get yeah, this is the first battery pack that I've done um, so I'm fairly new to this but just thought I'd give a brief overview of this particular spot welder um, that it's done well yes it triggers the fuse of the house if you do it too fast so if you do too many spot welds in a row it'll flick your safety switch um, but I've found that uh, yeah six six and a half four p um, this is pure nickel uh, strip, so I've tested this nickel strip, uh, scratching it up, soaking it in salt water to check that it didn't rust. So this is not plated, so it's pure, I think it was 0.5, 0.25 I think it was. I'd have to have a look, but um, with the thickness of the strip, hopefully uh, that's useful.